car. Here we are with Johnny Reed. Listen, is he going to be flat in turn one or is he going to be flat? Let's listen. You've got the throttle trace down below. Watch out. Is he flat out here? Let's listen. Absolutely flat out. No hint of a lift. And that's pretty impressive from Johnny Reed on his first qualifying run. And you could hear the bottom of the car was actually just clipping the racetrack as he came through turn four and then under brakes into turn two. Tremendous traction out of turn two. No hint of oversteer. Let's watch him down the hill into turn four. And then they've got to switch back to the other side of the road for the left-hander. Already three quarters of a second up as he goes through turn five. There is a patch in the racetrack that also affects the handling of the car just at the most critical part of turn five. On the power here. Again, tremendous traction, no wheel spin, no oversteer. It's much quicker turn eight than it looks. It's one of those corners, it's blind. You've got to hug the curb. Now get the car, get the speed off the car. Now get on the throttle because turn nine is easy to overdrive. Had a touch of oversteer that time. Now into the final section. Breaking on the turn. Bit of power on, that was neat. Final corner. Good exit, hard on the power, no trace of wheel spin again. This should be a very quick lap. Italy have set the new target. Let's see what New Zealand does. One of the best qualifiers of the season. He's in the 18s, a 118.2, only a tenth of a second slower than the fastest time we saw last year.